Hello everybody, it's me, Reyes Sapatia, the AZ Sports Guru, and I am here with another Sports Dot with the Guru. Uh, today's Sports Dot is NFL football. Yesterday, the Green Bay Packers beat the Chicago Bears 10-3, to uh, low-scoring defensive game, but in my opinion, it was boring. Um, the, both teams looked horrible. Green Bay was just fortunate to get a touchdown and get... Aaron Rodgers got hot there and found Jimmy Graham for for a score. Um, but to me, it, it sucks for the NFL. Um, Thursday night football is not a good idea. Uh, a lot of teams don't like it. Fan, NFL likes it because it's more money for them. Um, but teams don't get to prepare when they play a Sunday and then a Thursday game. And the bad thing about yesterday was... The, both of these teams, the Packers and the Bears, didn't have to play a game four days before. Um, they had plenty of time to be prepared, uh, and it still looked like a terrible game. Um, Aaron Rodgers is Aaron Rodgers. You know, he looked good. He started off very slow. Mitchell Trubisky had, had a terrible performance, two interceptions. Uh, like I said, game wasn't really worth watching. Uh, but everybody watched it because it's the NFL. Uh, it was the opening night. Uh, so I'm looking forward to this weekend. Uh, hopefully there's going to be a lot better games. Um, here in Arizona, the Cardinals with Kyler Murray, Cliff Kingsbury. Uh, that's going to be one to watch. The Raiders on Monday night are going to be one to watch just because what's Antonio Brown going to do on and off the field. Um and then you have the Redskins and the Giants and a couple other teams that will watch the Dolphins because it's when is that other quarterback going to play. Um, so have a good day. That's my thought for today. Um, I'll put another video out probably Sunday morning or Sunday night. Um, the podcast will be back next week. You can always check out uh, – the website, www.theazsportsguru.blogspot.com. Follow me on Facebook and Twitter at The AZ Sports Guru. Thank you guys. Have a good day.